Are you struggling to find the purpose in your life? Do you know what is the difference between goal and purpose of life? Do you know which are the two most important days in your life? Friends, welcome to DYD series. I am Dr. Ravi Kumilya, author of Amazon bestseller book and founder of Happy Life Foundation. The two most important day of your life is the day one is the day when you are born, right? And the second day, the day you will come to know why you have born. Yes, the, way, the day when you will come to know what is the purpose of your life. All the human beings can have different goals. For example, I want to become a doctor or engineer or the cricketer or the musician or painter, anything. This can be my different, different goals and it will vary from, it is subjective, it will vary from person to person. But friends, the purpose of human life, human being is common for all. Not only the human being have common purpose, but in this universe, in this nature, creator has created everything, whether it is planet, whether it is elements, whether it is five tattvas, or whether it is human being, animals, everyone, everyone has some fixed purpose. If you take an example of seed, if you sow the seed, it also wants to grow and it, it wants to sprout. It grows into the trees, branches, it grows into the huge tree and the fruits. And after growing, what the tree does, it gives. It doesn't grow the fruits for itself. It gives. So it has a nature of giving. So the common purpose, in if you, if you see in the nature, is to grow and share. Even the water, even the one drop of water wants to be a part of ocean, wants to be grow everything in the nature wants to grow all the elements all the pancha tattvas you know past five tattvas five elements five tattvas water earth air space and fire everything is giving something or other way and everything is evolving in their journey similarly the human life is also here to grow to evolve and to give back to the society even this body if you take the example of this body this we have taken as a loan from this five tattva you know this is made up of five tattvas and one day we have to give it back also growth is very natural if you see if you take an example of human being when we were in our mother's womb we were just one tiny cell and in the course of time today we are trillions of cells so the growth is natural you know so the purpose the sole purpose of human beings all the human beings is to grow and give so grow in what sense grow physically grow mentally grow socially grow emotionally grow spiritually basically there are two planes one is physical plane so we will call it as materialistic plane and second is the spiritual plane so we must grow with each and every aspect of our life we are here to grow continuously in materialistic world as well as we must evolve that is the sole purpose of human life human being we our soul must evolve must grow and what we should do after developing our skills after growing we must share to the society we must share to the world if you have more money share it if you have good knowledge share it you have skills share it you have the peace share the peace with others if you have happiness share with others but if you don't grow it you have to grow it first and then share it the sole purpose of human being is to grow so are you growing are you educating yourself? Are you growing mentally, socially, spiritually? If you are not growing in all the aspects of your life, that means you are living the life by accident. Along with the growth, nature also demands the balance in life. So in the next episode, I'm going to share what are the ingredients required to balance your life so that we all can have happy and peaceful life. Okay, see you soon. Goodbye. If you like the video, then please don't forget to share, like and subscribe the channel. Also.